don't mind the old mess on the clothes here. We just finished pouring 61 cubic yards in the ICF walls behind us. But I wanted to show you probably the best and easiest way to set a sauna tube that I've ever seen or a pile or a column, whatever you want to call it. But this, you can see this two by four here is braced back to the wall. Everything is set off of dimension. So whatever the prints tell it, so whatever the prints tell you to do for dimension, that way, like on an ICF, if you have a bit of a curve in the wall, you set it to dimension. That way when you straighten it out, it will straighten the pile and the dimension is still exactly what you wanted it to be. But really all this is, is this is sandwiched. There's no screwing or no messing around. This board's back to the wall. It goes here. This one here sits onto the, the pile cap or your footing pad, whatever you want to call it. So it holds it all up. This one braces it the other way. Then we have a 45 that sandwiches it, but also keeps the diagonal. So it gives it that strength laterally. So it's not just swaying. And finally, here, uh, turnbuckles. They're probably one of the handiest tools to have on a construction site. I'll do another clip on those of all the different uses, but you can see that, you know, I can set it, I can adjust it left or right, tweak it. I don't have to be deadly with my pins and then I have some adjustment. So that's it. The, probably the best, simplest way to set a pile. And because these piles and the way that Mike has set them is such a thing of beauty, I just wanted to show you the two that we did out front. And it's just so simple, same method, tied to the wall, one holds it all up. This one is your turnbuckle, you can adjust left and right. And like I said, everything's just based off dimension. That way, as you straighten the ICF wall, it actually keeps these plumb to the, to the same dimension that you need based off the print. So yeah, it's a thing of beauty. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, Please subscribe to our YouTube channel or check us out on some of the following.